hello everyone and welcome back it's your girl marquita with marquita lv luxury on today i have a few items that i would like to discuss and also we have to speak on these new releases but before we get started make sure you view my past videos like share and subscribe tell a friend how much fun we have over here don't forget to visit your girl on instagram at marquita lv luxury now that we have that out the way you guys know exactly what to do Go grab some wine or some tea and a light snack. Hurry back so we can get started. Only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Only gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Okay, besties, before I speak on the new collection that, I mean, just honestly blew my mind once I saw it in the lookbook and also on Instagram, I want to speak on this. This is absolutely adorable. I am really, really becoming a huge fan fan of handbags like this no i'm not a fan of the neo no way um but for some reason this color pink is absolutely beautiful it is releasing this friday no this is not something i will add to my collection but i also wanted to bring attention to it because any hot bag that louis vuitton releases that's what we do over here we speak on it i absolutely love this this is again from the summer holiday 2024 collection this is the lv flower ring launch date again july 19th the price three thousand three hundred and fifty dollars everything about this handbag is absolutely beautiful i'm loving the bag tag with this entire collection i am loving that they also have a small pochette inside the gold hardware guys this is beautiful this is absolutely beautiful there's also other colors coming out but this stood out to me the absolute most i absolutely adore this so if this is something that you have on your wish list or if you already pre-ordered you guys know i love for you to share with me or if you have already received it please send me a dm because this is absolutely stunning i just could not do this video without bringing attention to this handbag the next thing that i want to speak on i was going to speak on this last week but you guys know the hurricane came and just disrupted so many things here in houston power i mean the wind just it just just it just destroyed a lot of things and most definitely it destroyed me and my topics coming on youtube to speak to my besties but i have to speak on this no i don't need it but it's reverse monogram okay lv so you're re you're releasing reverse monogram I'm, I'm i'm okay with it you're releasing reverse monogram but you need to release the things that we really really want but this is a start I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the giant LV on this luggage, but it's reverse monogram. Again, I'm not quite sure if I'm a fan of the giant LV. And I'm looking down at it and I'm like, I'm trying to go past the large LV logo right there in the front. But again, it's reverse monogram. So how do you pass this up? I don't think we're ever going to get anything like this again. <sighs> lunch date is august 30th of this year of course and guys this is the lv horizon 55 i do have this already in monogram but why can't i have it in reverse monogram as well right let's think outside the box the price three thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars the red interior very nice but again the reverse monogram the giant print is kind of throwing me off and of course i am so glad that they went with the black leather especially with us traveling and guys yes this will be a carry-on we do not check these products in so if you pre-order 
if you're looking to pre-order i'm pretty sure pre-orders are probably start around july 30th it's always 30 days out depending on your rank depending on your tier depending on your ca but we i don't think we're going to see this again i am wanting the smaller monogram but if we have to just go ahead and and get this i think that's something we have to do our reverse monogram fans only you guys understand the real reverse monogram fans that's it okay so let me know how you feel about this of course i had to speak on this and uh, i'm kind of torn how do you feel about the large monogram on this okay let me know i want to talk about this guys i want to talk about this i'm not sure how to feel i'm not sure how to feel about the color combo with this whole entire collection okay i do at the moment have the monogram side trunk in the mm size i told you guys the love hate relationship that i have with that handbag but i will never ever ever get rid of this handbag out of my collection it just it's just a classy handbag um dress up dress down but most definitely dress up it just screams wealthy it just screams i'm coming through get out the way you see me I love the side trunk and I love that I have the monogram and I love that it's treated with Shetta as well. Still spray with Apple Guard. I learned my lesson. But how do you guys feel about this? This is a new launch that is coming August the 2nd of this year. The price $3,950 and guys, you guys know the price increase is most definitely there. Um, The color combo is kind of throwing me off. I don't know. I think this is something that we honestly have to see in person. If this is something that you are interested in, please let me know. I don't know. A lot of you guys sent this to my DM. I couldn't respond. Like I said, I was dealing with things from the hurricane last week. But I, I'm here to speak on it. The color combo is kind of throwing me off. Again, this is something we, we need to go in person and see especially for that that price okay this is well over four thousand dollars with tax and guys we pay for things that we want okay so let's let's move past the price increase let's move past all that other stuff that i'm starting to see that's circling around instagram in regards to lb pricing um this is a luxury brand so we are paying for the things that we want yes the quality isn't top tier like it was years ago so guys it's basically up to us if we're going to continue to purchase but i am loving how lv is rolling out the east west i'm loving it i'm falling in love with it so much and for some reason i like the color better on this i don't know why I don't know why I'm loving the inside. So if you have a Matisse East West, let me know how much do you actually fit inside of this handbag. I told you guys I am kind of steering away from smaller handbags, crossbody handbags that are smaller because of the amount that we are paying. And if it's not holding my daily essentials, I'm just not going to rock with it because it's just going to sit in my collection like the other handbags do. So if you have a Matisse East West, let me know what actually fits in send me a picture to my dm because i love the color combo for some reason on this handbag versus the side trunk mm i don't know what it is again lunch date is august the 2nd and of course there are going to be more handbags coming out in this collection they're just not giving us the side trunk and reverse monogram black leather. We need that, okay? You gave us the luggage. You gave us the Horizon 55. Why not give us the handbag? Okay, so I wanted to speak on that. Let me know how you feel. Um, does the color kind of throw you off with this collection? Or is it just me? Because I'm looking for something else instead of this, okay? So again, this whole collection, more handbags are coming out August the 2nd. Keep that in mind if you are interested. And guys, yes, pre-orders are open. It's past the 30-day mark. Reach out to your CA. You can, 
guys you can go into these boutiques if you don't have a ca please don't feel defeated by hey i'm never going to be able to pre-order because i can't find a ca there are cas on instagram and if you don't feel comfortable with the cas on instagram guys go into the boutique i mean you can pre-order inside the store you know that right move forward do it don't wait around if this is what you really want okay I have been waiting on this like I wanted to speak on this last week LV has just wowed us with this this color combo is absolutely uh, it's stunning I was trying to like picture in my head when I first saw this I couldn't really picture from the lookbook but now that we have clear images how this will look with silver but I want to say this before we get deep down into this collection. Guys, I didn't think this was going to make it past production. When I first heard about it, I did not think LV would give us this shade of gray. I just, for some reason, I was just like, okay, this is going to be on the runway. You know, we're going to be there to admire the handbags on these models. They're going to send it to some influencers, throw it in our face. We're not getting it we are getting it okay so the lunch date is august the 2nd i am going to start with the lv neo noe bb no i am not a fan of the neo noe i've had six in total got rid of all of them i've had every size they just set in my collection i'm not sure if it's because i had too many handbags at that time or i just really didn't dig this design but i never even wanted to figure that part out. I just got rid of them. I wasn't using them. So this beauty is coming out August the 2nd. That's the entire collection launch date, okay? August the 2nd. But the price for this Neo Noe BB, $3,450. We are most definitely paying for the color and that tote handle, guys. You see that. I love that they have this leather gray strap that matches the handbag I'm loving this this is perfection this whole entire line is perfection microfiber material inside smooth and I just know it smells good I know it smells delicious guys I'm loving it but for that price guys even though it's a neo noe in the BB size they could have threw in like just a small post shit okay I'm, I'm not complaining just a small post shit I'm just saying, but absolutely adorable. So if you are a fan of the Neo Noe, just period, even in the BB size, let me know in the comments if this is a handbag that you honestly would be interested in. I'm not a fan of this because I have the Vanity PM, but it's coming out, guys, in the LV Vanity Chain pouch. You know, this recently came out in the reverse monogram print as well, but this color combo together it makes me want to just purchase this handbag and also guys with this handbag i want the bag tag <laughs> i want the bag tag this is absolutely adorable guys they still give us this beautiful leather and gold chain strap that we all love and adore i think this is going to be absolutely beautiful guys as a tote handbag I don't even care about the plain gray leather strap at all. So if you are a fan, guys, the Vanity Chain pouch is coming out. I just feel like it's kind of too small. But the inside, we still get the smooth microfiber material and the matching gray interior and exterior. Kudos, LB. You most definitely did your thing, okay? Why am I getting excited? Why am I getting excited? Oh, my gosh. Okay. So guys, let's speak on this. And guys, yes, I get excited when I speak about handbags. The Alma handbag. Okay. The Alma BB. You guys know I have a few in my collection. Um, the classic prints, I, I got rid of those, but I kept my Epi leather. I absolutely love having them in my collection. But can we talk about this? I have both of my Alma handbags, the Alma PM, and I also have the um, Alma BB in my collection. Let's speak on it, okay? I, I, I just want to speak on it right quick. So, these two handbags, right? Alma BB, Alma PM. 
Do you guys agree there should have been like a middle point? I know it's an Alma GM, okay? I know it's an Alma GM, but I'm talking about as far as the size. I think it should have been an Alma PM, but smaller, and then an Alma MM and an Alma GM. You guys understand what I'm saying? Like, honestly, this is too big of a difference in size. It's too big of a difference in size. I would have wanted something larger. I, I would have wanted something larger in this print, okay? I don't know. It's just me. When I look at it in this gray, I would have just wanted something larger than the Alma BB. But guys, at this point, we just have to be thankful. And I can fit a few of my daily essentials in there. It's just me. I would want something that I can carry and use every day. And this color is up my alley, okay? This, I love gray. I love gray. I love black. I love nude. I love tan. I love those colors. Okay, so let's go into some details. You guys see that it has the beautiful leather and gold chain strap that comes with it, guys. It stands out so much up against this handbag. I love the bag tag. I would not get this high stamped. I wouldn't get it high stamped at all. Um, also, the interior, the smooth, gray, beautiful microfiber interior. Of course, it has a side pocket to where you can hold your cars if you like. But everything is perfect. Everything is perfect. It's just for me, I would want it to be a little bit bigger than the Alma BB. Not complaining because it's still purchase worthy to me. I love it. Of course, launch date is August the 2nd. The price for it is $2,850, guys, and I feel that it's fair, okay? It's fair. This is, it is beautiful. It's fair. And it's also going to be released in the beautiful black, but I am honestly feeling the, the gray a lot more, guys, than the black. Yes, I love the color black, but for some reason, LV releasing this dark gray is everything to me um the smooth microfiber material inside as well guys and it's black on black so black on the inside black on the outside but again i am loving the gray i am loving the gray and i want to speak on this as well so do you see that it still comes with a plain leather strap it still comes with a plain leather strap and they are also providing the gold and gray leather strap as well. So we're getting two straps with the handbag or is the strap short to where it's going to hang in the front? So I need to see a like a full view of this strap. But they're giving us two straps and guys, $2,850 isn't bad. Okay, we have to start counting our blessings here. So let me know how you feel, guys. I just feel like they should have most definitely went all the way with this collection. They should have just, just rolled out a Speedy 20. We needed a Never Full. We needed a Never Full from this collection. It seems like they gave us all smaller handbags. But a Never Full, I think that most definitely would have done, uh, would have done us right. I'm, I'm, I'm excited about this collection. I just feel the only ball that they dropped is not releasing larger handbags. And guys, I'm going to show you more pictures. Um, I'm trying to kind of break this thing up a little bit. Like I said, last week kind of messed up my schedule. But I'm going to end it here because I don't want the video to be super, super long. And yes, we will be talking a lot this week because I'm cramming next week and this week all into one but i just want to say thank you guys for all of the prayers um it's a lot going on i'm tired i'm i'm mentally drained i am tired but i made a promise that i was going to start being more consistent and, and start throwing out these videos so guys i am going on probably like three to four hours of rest right now um but I am going to come through with the videos, okay? I also want to say this, guys. A lot of you guys are happy. You're like, oh, Marquita, we are getting an on-the-go tote PM in this. I see info posted. Guys, that information was just recently, like, 
given to us um as of right now it's not a for sure thing but it is on the cancellation so i'm not sure what's going on with that like i said i didn't even think this whole collection was going to make it into production so the on the go tote pm it was worded that it's going to be canceled okay and like i said i just seen info posted in his stories a couple of hours ago um i'm receiving the same information but keeping our fingers crossed because we want something larger than the alma bb so again keep our fingers crossed with the on the go tote pm i hear things different things all day long my dm my phone messages i hear about lv all day long and some of the things that i can share i bring them here to you so the on the go from the monogram ink collection is on the cancellation list but we are going to keep our fingers crossed that they actually drop that handbag and let's just be happy that this whole collection made it out of production okay so i wanted to point that out to you guys as well guys thank you so much for tuning in um we are going to be seeing a lot of new releases in the next couple of days so guys just bear with me as i try to drop these videos um if i am absent for any reason you guys yes i will update you but as of right now it's going good i am blessed to still be here and i am still praying for those that do not have power so guys keep all of houstonians in your prayers so guys as always stay safe stay blessed until next video Mwah. bye bye